And here we go. Night number two of WrestleMania 37. We are kicking things off big with The Fiend versus Randy Orton. And look at that gear. Randy Orton. That is awesome. White, and white, red and black gear. Randy, that is so not you. But I am digging it. Randy, uh with shades of his younger self, with different colored trunks. All turn in for a challenge here. He's got to take on the charcoal fiend. Let's do it. The fiend is getting a special entrance. I wondered if it was gonna be something different. I don't know where he is. He looks like he's in some sort of tunnel and he's got this black cloth over him. Now he's burning and it's the old fiend. I'm so, hang on, is that? It's the non-burn fiend. Now the lights are going out. Randy looks just as confused as us. Ah, there's the drones that everyone on Instagram's been talking about. But I don't get it. Is burn fiend not wrestling? Is it? Is other fiend back already? I'm I'm so confused. There's the jingle. We all know that music. And that's for Alexa Bliss. And here she is on the stage at WrestleMania. Has she got anything to say? Is she coming to the ring? I'm really confused. Randy's itching for a fight. It looks like Alexa's coming down to the ring. There is a giant box appeared at ringside and it is a jack-in-the-box it's what alexa bliss has been carrying around it's the fiend jack-in-the-box there's a giant life-sized human-sized one is alexa gonna wind round the handle and is the fiend gonna pop out the top it looks like that's what's gonna happen randy looks very almost Scared but intrigued. And Alexa's winding it up. There's the music. The top of the box has opened. And it's the fiend. But it's the non-burn fiend. It's Bray Wyatt. It's the normal fiend, guys. The mask looks different, though. Looks more evil. But, guys, that's the normal fiend. That isn't the burned fiend. Is that even Bray Wyatt? I think it is. He's slimmed down a lot. I'm, you know, I, I'm surprised by this. I didn't think we'd be getting this Bray back. I thought we were having the Burn Fiend for a long time. And he was going to gradually come back. But apparently not. He shed the burned skin. And this is the normal Bray. He's back once again. And he's coming for Randy Orton. The only difference is now he's wearing a long vest-like t-shirt. Uh, no, he's wearing a long shirt with a vest over the top. And that mask is definitely different. And the Bray Wyatt's just dived off of the, the Jack in the Box. And now he's going straight after Randy Orton. That mask is different, guys. I'm telling you now it's different. It's a more evil, angry-looking fiend mask. Oh yeah, and the smile is much wider. That's a lot more creepy, but I really like that one. I like that one a lot more than I did the other one. And now Randy Orton about to get his neck snapped by the Fiend. Look at him. He's terrifying. But I love the new mask. It's like he's staring into my soul, guys. 
Bray going to the corner, maybe looking to put this one away quickly. Screaming at the crowd. Sister Abigail inbound. No. He's going to punt him. Bray Wyatt going to hit the, the punt kick on Randy. Surely not. Randy rolls out of the way, smart thinking. Randy moves out of harm's way. Randy looking for a second hangman's DDT. He hits one. He's hit one already and Bray stood right back up. There it is. There's a second. Will the Fiend get once? Well, will he get up again? He stayed down a little bit longer, only a few seconds, but he's still down. Randy back up to his feet. He's got the Fiend on his knees and now stomping on his hand. And the Fiend just looking at him like it hasn't done anything. I like that new mask. I really do. I can't stop talking about it. It just looks, it's the same as the normal Fiend mask, but the smile is much wider and the eyebrows are much more angrier. Ah, oh, now these two standing face to face. The Fiend is up to his feet. Kick to the gut by Randy, bouncing off the ropes. And bro, big clothesline by The Fiend. Bray Wyatt. Going for another clothesline. No, this time. Oh, and there's the crossbody. Cover him. And now Bray, The Fiend, repeated forearm straight to the head of Randy Orton. Standing atop of him. I thought this match was going to be a squash, I'm not going to lie. There's the senton. Randy rolls out of the way. Quickly, Randy, stop. You're wasting time. Get up. Hit him with the RKO. You know you're not going to be able to put him away quickly. And the Fiend sent to the outside. Quick thinking there by the Viper. Randy getting in position for the RKO. The Fiend reverses it into the Mandible Claw. And this could be it. Guys, one thing that I didn't uh, point out initially is the red lighting is back. The red lighting has stuck throughout this match, but the Mandible Claw still applied to Randy Orton. Randy just trying to take down The Fiend here. But no, somehow managing to reverse it, but The Fiend's got him now. Oh no, kiss to the forehead. We all know what comes next. Wait, wait, wait. Flames have just come in all four corners. Alexa Bliss is sitting atop the box and she is, she's just got black liquid pouring down her head. Wearing what looks to be like a crown of thorns. I'm so confused. The Fiend putting his hand out towards her, but... Oh! RKO! RKO out of nowhere! Cover one, two, three! <gasps> no! No way! What? Randy Orton has just pinned The Fiend. Alexa Bliss is still atop that box. My Amazon Echo is going crazy. Shh, shh, Alexa, stop. Guys, I am in disbelief. Bliss just cost The Fiend the match. She's still sitting atop the box, looking down on The Fiend. The Fiend looks angry these two just staring at each other oh one thing you can notice now the lighting's gone is the fiend now has red eyes i'm so confused uh oh the light's going down again guys they're out are we gonna see anything more are we gonna hear the sirens or is that it And just like that, they're both gone. What? What does this mean for The Fiend and Alexa Bliss? I'll see you guys in the next video.